Well, of course, we keep reminding you we are heading into Labor Day weekend. Like right now, you're probably sitting on your couch watching this or wherever you are, and, and it is your Labor Day weekend, so happy Labor Day weekend. We have the chef from King Tide Fish and Shell here to give us some ideas about what kind of things to put on the grill. Normally you might think of hot dogs, hamburgers, maybe some ribs if you want to go crazy, but that is not what you guys are doing. Right. Obviously it's King Tide Fish and Shell, yeah. so we've got some <laughs> seafood, some veggies. Correct, and I mean there's nothing wrong with burgers and ribs, you know, I, right. lo I love ribs, but you know, there's, you there's, there's so many options you can do. I mean, you know, we got, we, did, we made some uh, fish tacos, we got some oysters yes. that, you know, just you know, with a little uh, enhanced batter, and then we also have a, a flatbread, just kind of like taking advantage of the uh, perfect yeah. season of tomatoes right now. So yeah, you've got yeah. tomatoes on these fish yeah. tacos. Tomatoes you got all avocado. The way. Yeah, a little kind of like you know a little salsa or pico, if you will. You know, mm -hmm. little lime juice, avocado, jalapeno. Um, what about the flatbread? What all did you put on there? So this has got a little uh, uh, goat cheese with a little uh, heirloom tomatoes that are kind of slightly marinated in vinegar and uh, extra virgin olive oil. And then we also grilled some eggplant and made a puree. So you get a little bit of the smokiness. And then just the flatbread, I mean, it's, it's super easy to make. You know, throw it in the grill, get those grill marks, get that crust and that, you know, little different smoke and mm -hmm. flavor. It's, it's actually pretty pretty amazing. Can I try it? Oh, please. Like, you just keep talking about all these yeah. delicious things that are on there. I want to get a bite with with everything in there. Yeah, there you go. Mm. You know how you know how to do it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and now I can't talk. Yeah. So that's um, so good. You can tell the marinating that you talked about. Mm -hmm. Nice, mm -hmm. nice. I also brought some uh, oysters for you know, so uh, you know, you build them up and uh, show you how to uh, how to shock them and mm -hmm. and then um, you know, dress them. I mean, look at this. This is nice and and beautiful, super fresh. Look at those juices. And then just basically, uh, we made the, uh, we call it a compound butter, and then we flavor it with uh, kind of like a, a rock of fire, which is like a, an old school uh, New Orleans dish. Oh, this is all you do, uh -huh. throw in the barbie, and I then you know, a, couple, a couple minutes and you know, pull it out. It's gonna be And it looks so fancy, bubbling. but it, it's like, seems it's pretty easy It's super simple, it's really easy. I mean, you make the butter. The, the, the hardest thing is gonna be your compound butter. Just make it a day ahead or so. What and then goes in have that? it ready. Uh, there's garlic, onions, uh, a little watercress, a little spinach, uh, onions. Okay. Um, I, we're sharing the recipe. Um, so Perfect. Can, if they wanna try it at home, then how they absolutely can. Now trying it in the studio, we've of course, you know it's Friday, we're going to the holiday weekend. Al, Rick, do you guys wanna come, come taste some of these things? We've got fish tacos, we've got the flatbread. Rick's like, oh, I don't know, I don't wanna yeah. do this yet. All, all of this is also on our menu right now. This is going live uh, on Tuesday for dinner. Uh, this is on the menu right now. Those are on the lunch menu as well. So if you are uh, if you don't wanna cook at home, like you can always come down and you know, avoid the uh, the, the grilling, but exactly you can way. avoid it or you can do it because all this stuff seems like fairly easy to make Al do you think you could do some of this? I think I could probably handle maybe some oysters right? on the grill and maybe yeah. the flatbread. The yeah. flatbread is so good But I, I think I could actually make it. What do you think Rick? It's amazing. Thumbs up on the flatbread for sure And where can people right. find you if they so, want to come check so, out King so Tide Fish and Show? I get to keep my job? I think so. Yes, we will say. We will call your boss. Yeah, so we're uh, Laurel we're, gets to keep his job. <laughs> we're located at the uh, River Place Hotel uh, it's a beautiful view while well, you sit there. Yeah, it's uh, yeah, right by the food. river. Well, thank you so much, Chef Laura Romero, everybody else for watching the show. You know, we've been, I've been like racing and running around all day, so this food is delicious and so much appreciated. Have a great long weekend, but we will be here on Monday, guys. So we will see you then. Have a great one.